Welcome to the final step in your CP2 project. It's called Learn, Master, Teach. You learn the skills, you practice and master them in class, and then you teach them to the students coming behind you next semester. The goal of this project is to create a tutorial, a video lesson, using the two softwares, Camtasia and Logic, using the guidelines I'm gonna lay out in front of us. Here are the guidelines for the project. Number one, your topic must be from the suggested topic list. Number two, the Camtasia project must be under four minutes. If it's going to be over four minutes, we need to break it into two videos. And the third guideline is the project must have three smart focuses and at least five annotations. Let's go through the step-by-step -step process you'll need to create a successful tutorial. Here we go with the steps you need. Step number one, select your topic from the suggested topic list. Step number two, practice your skill in a new logic project. You're going to want to be really good at creating that skill because the camera is going to be on you recording it very shortly. Step number three, record that skill. Record yourself in Camtasia. Remember, you can edit everything later, but you don't want to have too many mistakes or you'll be doing a lot of editing. Step number four, edit that video in Camtasia and include all of the annotations. Step number five, watch your video and write a script. You're going to narrate this video. Write the script in a Google Doc, word for word, with your video playing. Step number six, record your voice in a new logic project while you watch the movie. Step seven, export the audio out of logic. Remember, that's a bounce. So you bounce it to an MP3 out of logic and then you bring it into Camtasia and line up that video and audio. Step number eight, share that tutorial with me and we'll post it on home base. Let's talk about some of the grading. When thinking about the grades, these are the questions that we'll be asking ourselves. Number one, did it follow the project guidelines of under four minutes? Did it use the correct amount of annotations and zoom-ins? Did you meet the deadline for the project? And did you work consistently each day during class on that project? To be more specific about the grading, please take a look at the rubric attached on this webpage. Okay, let's get started. Are you ready? Here we go. You'll want to click the suggested topic link and fill in the topic that you want to do. If you have your own idea, you're going to want me to approve that. And then open up a new project in Logic and start getting really good at creating that skill with as few mistakes as possible so you can get ready to make your movie. Have fun. The project is called Learn, Master, Teach. It's the final step in CP2. Congratulations for getting this far. I'll see you out there.